Hello guys, welcome back to LearnApp. For today's video, we are going to show you how to connect Porkbun domain to Squarespace. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. So you might be wondering, how do you exactly connect your Porkbun domain to Squarespace? Well, this one is fairly easy. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to porkbun.com. And from here, what we need to do is we want to go ahead and open up our uh, Squarespace website. Now, in our website, you want to go ahead and go to your settings at the bottom left here. Go ahead and click on your settings. Click on domain and email and just click on domains. Now, in here, just choose the option here that says use a domain I own. Now, as an example here, I'm going to open up my domain here directly for Porkbun. And let's go and copy the following details. Go back into Squarespace, enter your domain, just press enter. And it's going to start the uh, process here. So in this case, you can go ahead and click on the option here that says connect domain. So connect the domain to your Squarespace website to get to manage it. Let's go and click on this one. Now from here, you want to go and choose your provider. So it will automatically uh, uh, choose that for you. But just in case it doesn't show that, what we need to do is we want to go ahead and choose other here. So we since we don't see uh, pork bun, let's go and click on connect domain. In this case, it's going to start the connection process. So just wait for a bit here until the connection is complete. Let's go and click on continue. And from here, we just need to add the following details. So in this case, you want to go ahead and go back into pork bun and you want to go and click on DNS. And from here, scroll down a bit here. Now, typically speaking, we have the quick DNS config, which is a great tool that you could use to basically start managing whatever information you have here. Now, the great thing about the quick config here, it auto automatically add the DNS information. So let's go and choose Squarespace, click on OK, and it's going to start adding those records that we saw before. And from here, it's going to ask like additional DNS requirements. So the subdomain must be the exact verification code given to you by Squarespace. So in this case, we want to go ahead and go back into Squarespace here. And from here, so let's go ahead and uh, start adding www, click on submit. Now it should say we were able to successfully update your DNS record. Let's go and click on OK and OK. And as you can see, it automatically added all the information that we need here. Now what we need to do next is we just need to go back into Squarespace. And from here, what we need to do next is we just need to click on refresh records to see if everything is actually verified. Now, by the way, it might take around like 24 to 48 hours in order for your domain to start working properly. So this uh, thing we call DNS propagation, it takes like 24 to 48 hours. But yeah, so just need to wait for that. And from then on, you should be good. And that's about it. Hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to your lineup. Thank you for watching.